Hop in arm. All right. One day later. Nudity warning probably coming up for anybody. Excuse me. Anybody that may be watching this in an office setting or anything like that, there may be some nudity. Not safe for work. Stuff coming up here, so just watch out for that. Hmm. It must suffice. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to his Imperial Majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the berger. The what now? In that kind of like my wife just got chair. back home, so maybe my mic. And if I am not back by the time. Catwin. We shave the gentleman sideburns to That's half the game. Inch. I'll just cut to it. Be right back. All right, cool. So, sorry about that. Let's. Yeah, fine. I don't. Fine. I don't mind if they shave it. Then what? I'm gonna do my nails too. Gotta know. If A little drinky permits. drink from Sonic. Sadly, the day is short. While the list of hygienic and cosmetic treatments that the gentleman should undergo is really rather long. Tilt your head back, please, and sit still. And prepare to answer some questions. General, I, I am not certain this is the appropriate time. I can't think of a better time. Men turn honest when they feel a blade at their throat. Movran Boris, commander of the Alba Division. Before they take you in to see the Emperor, Witcher, there's some information I need you to verify. It's a formality, but one that must be seen to. Sure. Paperwork's gotta be in order. So, Geralt of Rivia. Place of birth unknown. Parents unknown. Age unknown. All insignificant details. Let us proceed to more recent events. The siege of La Valette Castle. The fate of the defending commander, oh, one Arian. Oh no. We fought on opposing sides, true. Then we landed in the same dungeon. Arian escaped, set fire to the castle on his way out. So that is how the blade started. Our reports suggested the dragon was responsible. Moving on. You then found shelter in charming Flotsam, and from there made your way to Virgo. My question is how? I, I really don't know about any of this. It must be from older uh, other two games. A slayer so I'll just kind of guess and a what the stuff's going on here. Men. You forge interesting alliances. Something tells me my most interesting is yet to come. Go on, next question, before my beard grows back in. We shall shave you again if it does. Very well. The infamous summit at Loch Muin. You were there. And once again meddled in the affairs of the mighty. Number one. The mighty had imprisoned Triss Marigold. Ought to know I care about her, and I tend to rescue those I care about. And so you did, handing Radovid control of the Conclave and Council of Mages in the process. Nilfgaard recently started a war, unprovoked. So do us both a favor and stop moralizing. The gentleman must sit still. I'm almost done. I'm afraid I might find that difficult. Because, from what I know, shortly afterwards you watched a defective megascope blow your friend Sheila de Tanserville to bits. <sighs> An old acquaintance more like. Not so close that I felt bad for her, but close enough that I knew she deserved it. He believes he alone knows what is good and what is evil, and that this gives him the right to dispense justice. Your comrade Letho of Gullet described you so. Quite accurate. My comrade, your agent. Well, national interest calls on one to forge difficult alliances at times. 
alliances with witches included. Had an ongoing alliance? What's Letho up to? I had hoped you would answer that question. Ah, so Letho's hiding from you. Must have a good reason. Was there a shift in national interest that might have caused that? I don't know where he is. Wouldn't tell you if I did anyway. Blade or no blade to my throat. I believe that is all. Your signature, please, affirming you stated the whole truth and nothing but the truth on pain of imprisonment or death, etc., etc. Here, um, here. What we do? These formalities seem to, I would ask the general to leave the room. We shall be choosing the gentleman's attire. An important matter, but one that does not require the general's assistance. Shame. I might have given you some advice. So long, Garrett. Good luck with your audience. I hate those frilly things um, around their neck they used to wear. They used to be depicted to wear. Feels more like I'm being readied for a wedding. Were that so, I would have prepared the gentleman a frock, a tailcoat, or possibly a dinner jacket. In point of fact, the gentleman will choose from these garments. Black, black, or black. I'm gonna go with the one on the far right. We do not like garish colors in Nilfgaard. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. I already chose the far right one. This one. This might come as news to the gentleman. Told me to tell you once I chose the outfit, but all right, I'll put it on. Now let me talk to you. One's waist is not fitting attire for an audience. The gentleman will kindly dress. I literally did. Oh, no, yeah, I, I've done dress, bro. Oh, excuse me. I don't know why I burped. And they go. say clothes do not make the man. Does the outfit satisfy the gentleman? A studded doublet and a sword on my back, that's what would satisfy me. But tough, when in Nilfgaard. Yes. It's a saying. So what now? Powder my nose? No need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the ruler of the north and south. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. I'm not some boar. I know how to bow. Please, demonstrate. That, sir, is how you might bow <laughs> to a whore on a street corner. Not to the emperor of Nilfgaard. Please watch. Leg extended, hand flat, head down, chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. This is an extravagant bow. I... Yeah, this is absurd. Gotta be kidding. Not at all. I am mortally serious. Does the gentleman know the penalty for breaches of etiquette in the Emperor's presence? 200 lashes. Oof. I do not wish that upon him. So I will not let him leave until I am confident that he knows how to behave. Right leg forward. Left leg forward. Right hand on chest. Hmm. Lacking fluidity and grace. But we've learned to expect less of Nordlings. Come with me. One second, guys. For jest. Right, I'm back. Sorry about I that, everybody. The Emperor might not share his disposition. Your Majesty will suffice. Spoken loudly, clearly, and with respect. Till show evai.
in Grimmy et Art Kätze. Deifen Aden in Karn eb Marwut. Emir war Emreis. Wow. Fine, Abel. Your Imperial Majesty. It's a long, uh, cutscene. Area, whatever. Rebellion nam in Vatgen favort. I thought you bowed before no man. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends. Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so... Silence. My daughter, Cyrilla, she's returned. And she's in danger. The wild hunt pursues her. You will find her and bring her to me. Find me. How many men in your army? 20,000? 30? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you're looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you more than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. Oh. Save your generosity for those whose homes your armies have raised. I'll do it for Siri, not for your gold. Your motives do not interest me, only results. Yennefer will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. Meredith! Take him to the sorceress. And that seemed like a dick. I would, I would hope our government and whatnot is more willing to talk to their people. But and I kind of feel like they're not. The <laughs> Who knows, really, though? Please keep close. There are many not honorable me. guests there in the palace like... whom the gentleman disgusts. Need not bother. And it's past noon. Calm yourself. What? He just 100% walked through her. He is a ghost. I can't read everything they're saying. Let us go. This is so hot and boring. I want to get back to the action. I feel like I'm, I'm not getting to, you know, talk or anything throughout this because I, if I talk, I'm interrupting the gameplay, or not the gameplay, but the... As I was saying, I feel like I'm going to cut off the game for the cutscenes. Then transcribe. The true authority in Novigrad is not the city council or the merchants. So, alright. Again. Geralt, that tunic, you look positively smashing. Ugh, dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. Now do you understand why I'm at Amir's court? Mm-hmm. And seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, she's really back? No chance he's mistaken? Look, that's more or less what she looks like now, or so our agents claim. Oh, wow. Our little and witch has up. grown into a young lady. Uh, wife brought me chips in here, but I can't eat them recording, so I don't know where to put them. Right here for now. And the monitor. Alright, so. 30. Sorry about that. So they're our agents now? 
My, my. You've clearly settled in quick. Geralt, don't yep. twist my words. I know who Emir is. He started this war and its bloodshed. He had my friends killed. But I haven't any other choice. So please, let's not belabor the pros and cons and instead focus on finding Ciri. All right? Right. Amir said the wild hunts after her. I'd find that hard to believe before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Ciri, using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the wild hunt might sense it, perhaps even find me, but I thought I'd trick them. Well, guess you were wrong. Hmm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me, for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. You must find her, Geralt, before the Wild Hunt does. Right. Um... Yeah, I wonder what the Wild Hunt wants to do. What could it want from Ciri? I've no clue, Geralt. Might have written them to ask, but I don't have their address. <clears throat> I know as much as you Rude. do. I got a double chin. about her blood. Her gift. Well. As for what the hunt wishes to do with that gift, I... I prefer not to think about it, really. Where has Ciri so been? Ciri been seen, exactly? In two places. Velen and Novigrad. The like trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. He should get in touch with you. That's it? No passwords? Secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors. But there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Right. Tris Merigold. Apparently, she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Sure, she'll be delighted to see me. A lot to remember. What about you? What will you do? I shall sail for Skellige. There was a magic explosion there recently, blew half a forest down. I believe this had something to do with Ciri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. Right. Go on. I don't really care what the other thing had to say. Guess this means want we to get need to ready split for the quest. Again. Not my preference, but I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. So why don't I teleport you to Velen, get you there at once? Not gonna happen. I'll go on horseback, as soon as I can get changed. Have it your way? Oh, and... You really look quite dashing in black velvet. Think so? Maybe I can have some of my armor lined with it. <laughs> Good luck, Yen. Same to you. And if you wish to learn what's happened in the world while you and Vesemir roam the wilderness, talk to Ambassador Vartra. That's him over there. They don't Geralt, know if I care about I what know happened. it's wartime. I know. But try not to be a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me in one piece. Oh, she does care. I shall be waiting. A shame I have no time. Ooh, that is loud. I serve the gentleman by returning my things. What is that? That sound, that was loud. Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Mm. Thanks, bunches. <laughs> the Emperor is not known for his patience. He wants his daughter back safe and sound. As soon as possible. Uh, uh mention something of the sort. So long. Alright, I get my stuff back. So head on. Alrighty, and Cool. Let's get going. 
loud. Mm. You got something for me? Oh, Gwent, heck nah. See you. See you later. I do not like Gwent. But yeah, my card game first. I don't like Gwent. Fast travel. Fast travel, I just need it. That suck. Okay, whatever. No man's land. Let's go. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching my video. If you liked it, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. And you want to see more videos by me? Hit the subscribe button. You'll be notified every time I post a new video, and you'll be able to see it in your sub box. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. This has been Kados Gaming, signing out.